Okay, so we're going to be using the low row for back development. Um, so I'm going to show you two variations. One is an overhand grip. You can use this as an alternative to pull-ups or chins. The other hand is an underhand grip. We can use that for back development, but also for bicep development as well. So the overhand grip. If you can't do a full pull-up, this is a great variation of it. Take your hands slightly wider than your shoulder width apart. Heels on the ground. Just lift it so your chest is slightly in front of the bar. And then you're going to pull yourself up. And then just hold at the top. So you're aiming to try and get as high and as close to the bar as possible. Pull yourself up and back down. If you want to make it a little bit easier, you can flare your elbows out. And that will change the tension on your back. You can also make it easier by creating a bridge with your feet. So rather than having them straight out, create a bridge with your feet. So start off with your bends on the ground rather than straight. That will create a bridge motion. And then that allows you to use your legs to give yourself a little bit of support as you pull yourself up. The underhand grip, we're going to do the same way. But we're just turning our hands so our palms are facing each other. This one's going to work with your biceps a little bit more so it'll give some bicep development as well as your back. So our arms out straight, legs out straight. Put yourself up, pause at the top, control it down. And again, if you want to, you can make it easier. So bend your knees, pull yourself up so you can use your legs to lever. You can also use a close grip. And this will focus more on the biceps. So you can focus more on the biceps rather than the back by bringing your hands in.